This video shows you how to measure your dog for one of our garments, in particular the dog jumper, the dog tanky and the dog suit, where it is really important to have a good fit for your dog. The first measurement is the length and that is taken from the breastbone at the front of your dog. So it's the Adam's apple bone that sticks out just at the base of the collar here. So I'm going to try and get Pip in here to stand. Good girl, good girl. There. And so you start on that breastbone, go round the shoulder and then straight up to the base of the tail in a bit of an arc like that. Now she's measuring 28 and a half. The second measurement is to measure the neck just about where the collar goes, maybe a little bit above, and that's 18. The third measurement is the chest or the girth. And it's quite important to get this a snug fit, not loose, but not tight. So just fitting to the body. And that one's measuring at 29 inches. The fourth one is the waist. Again, snug to the body, not loose, not tight. That's 23 inches. And the last one is the backbone. Here, yeah, good girl. Which is from the base of the neck to the top of the tail. Now, when we say the base of the neck, that means if your dog is looking at something exciting, like a rabbit, it's the dent where the neck and the body meet on the backbone and take it down again to the base of the tail and that's 24 inches. Now if I was putting all those measurements into the sizing calculator I know that would turn out a 28 inch for a suit, a jumper, a tanky, a polar neck coat and the dog coat. Uh, so 28 or 28 Labrador.